Hello everyone, hola a todos. Today we are going to review how to use the markers to exit the position. Let's say we are entering on a trade manually. For example, this is the ATR bar color where we have an entry here. And the possible exit will be the breakout of the trend line on the blue arrow but for those who trade who prefer to enter the trade manually um, let's say we are long now we can use the markers to enter instead of using the markers to enter the trade we can use it to exit the trade so we set, for example, I will use a vertical line to enter long, a vertical line to enter short, because I am going to put these lines uh, myself, so we enter manually, and then using the exit conditions uh, to exit um, along I want a red arrow to exit a short I want a blue arrow so the opposite to the standard and I will use the same account So I, I am not taking the entries right now. <clears throat> Let's say I choose any ATM. Instead of entering the market, I will enable the long side, for example, and place a vertical line. When I put the vertical line, it is detected, if it is blue of course so let's say I have my vertical line ready for a trade for a don't trade and another vertical line ready for a short So I have both manual entries uh, ready to be used. So I want to enter long now. So I click on the long. Move the vertical line near the price action. Order pen order it filled. It is detected by the system. And now I am long, same as I was using the buy market, but the entry was uh, executed by markers. So now it is in place the exit condition that means that when a red arrow like this one shows this trade will be um, closed let's move the Tar target far enough I am not entering more trades. I am only waiting for an exit condition. In fact, I, I don't want the, the training stop. To remove the training stop, we can use the DOM. On the DOM, we can select the instrument. And here we can see the, the training stop. 
we right click and remove the auto trail that's all so we don't have the trailing stop working anymore because uh, I, what I want to show is not triggering the trailing stop but to show how the markers will exit the position when a red arrow is detected that will happen at the following Just as a reminder, in, on the ATR bar color, we have a neutral zone between the long and the short side. If we want to use a setup that switches from short to long without a neutral zone, we can use the super trend. We can see we have a yellow arrow, a yellow bar, because we are breaking the current trend line. So we are creating a pivot. Market has to break that pivot to be in short mode. This is for the ATR, set, uh, the ATR bar color setup. This is a pivot to break. If the pivot is broken at the end of the bar, the ATR bar color will switch to short mode. So it should Target place filled. a red arrow, but this red, this red arrow is only closing the previous long. Okay, thank you everyone. See you, bye bye.